Hey guys, it's Jack the Critic, and today we are going over my updated DVD collection. I know the last uh, update I did was two months ago, but it's grown a lot since then. So, let's first DVD is The Breakfast Club, the 30th anniversary Blu-ray. Comes with the digital copy. Insidious Blu-ray. Pretty good Blu-ray. Die Hard, one of my favorite films of all time. And it comes with the DVD as well. It is Blu-ray plus DVD. Kingsman the Golden Circle in 4K Ultra, Blu-ray and digital. Pretty good film. I actually did like it. It's not as good as the first one, but still good. A Quiet Place, which you guys know is one of my favorite films of 2018. Just a brilliant horror film. And it's certified fresh on Rotten Tomatoes, and I'm happy about that. It has Blu-ray, DVD, and digital. Got it on the digital and DVD, so that's perfect. Logan's Run on Blu-ray. Lord of the Rings 3 Film Collection. Brilliant films, by the way, and just some of the best films ever made. In my opinion, this could be the best trilogy ever made. Kingsman The Secret Service, which is a great film. Scream 2, really great film. Scream, very good. I love Scream. Next film we have is Sandlot, true classic in my opinion. Jurassic Park, another classic. Really good. League of Their Own, still haven't checked this out yet, but I'll probably review it around baseball season, so be on the lookout for that. Corpse Bride, the full screen edition. Uh, I do like this movie actually, it's a pretty good film. Um, yeah. Scott Pilgrim Saves the World. Really good film. I really love Scott Pilgrim. Super Mario Brothers. Still haven't checked it out, but I will watch it and give you guys in the... Probably, this might be a really bad movie, but we'll just have to wait and see. Euler Bueller edition of Ferris Bueller's Day Off. I love this film. Okay, good. My favorite Harry Potter film, Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. The I Am Spider Man personalized DVD. Uh, I remember all that good stuff. Paddington, really good film, in my opinion. One of my favorite family films. Psycho. It's in my top five favorite horror films. Just a really good horror film. Avengers Infinity War. And I really love Infinity War. Infinity War was one of the best films. In my opinion, it's one of the best films ever made. Avengers Infinity War. Blade Runner 2049, great film. Blade Runner The Final Cut, great film. Blade Runner The Director's Cut, is a very older, is a much older DVD. But, I love it. Pretty good cut. Not as good as the final, but so good. Jaws 2, I do have the first film, but it's somewhere in storage, because that's actually my dad's. But this, I got for Christmas. That made my dad mad, because he hates it. A very bad copy of Ghost Rider Spirit of Vengeance. Damaged. Really damaged. I have the first Avengers DVD as well, but it's downstairs. Back to the Future Part 2. Spider Man from 2002, the widescreen edition. I used to have the full screen edition, but I don't have that anymore. I have the widescreen. Absolutely love this film. You guys know that. It's amazing, in my opinion, one of the best superhero films ever made. Just a really fantastic film. Love Spider-Man. Spider-Man 2 is might be better, because I really love Spider-Man 2, but this film I still love a lot. Great film. It, from 1990. Really like the first half, hate the second half though, but memories. The Boogeyman Killer Compilation. On the back you got... Pinhead, Freddy Krueger, Leatherface, Ghostface, Chucky, Candyman, Leprechaun, Simon, Wishmaster, Camilla, Fisherman, The Dentist, The Tallman, Blade, Norman Bates, Jason Voorhees, and Michael Myers. It from 2017. Love this film a lot. Spider-Man Homecoming, just another really good film. Really great Spider-Man film. It was a big step up from The Amazing Spider-Man 2, which in my opinion, is it's bad. Yeah, it's not that good. But, Spider-Man Homecoming, big step up, and 
They rebooted it again, but it was worth it. This is a great film. Nightmare Before Christmas, one of my favorite films of all time. Cool Cat, the kid's suit. Yes, I actually bought this on DVD. You know, I had the first one, so I might as well have the second one. But by that, I mean, I might as well get the extended edition of the first one. Film still sucks. But it's one of those films that is so bad that it's good. I appreciate it because of how bad it is. But it's one of those films where it's so bad that you can watch it every day. Except I don't watch it every day. I really think it's bad. But it's one of those kinds of films to me. Cool Cat Saves the Kids. Triple X. Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. I actually don't think this film is that bad. A lot of people hate it, but I thought it was okay. Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. This is a great film. Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Great film. My favorite one, Raiders of the Lost Star. Just a great film. It's amazing. Halloween. Fantastic film. Halloween 2 and 3. In my opinion, both are pretty good films. I really like Halloween 2 because I tried something original, but you know, when you rewatch, it's not as good as I really thought it'd be, but it's still a really underrated film, and I do like it. And Halloween 2 is pretty good too. Halloween 4, The Return of Michael Myers, Special Divin Max Edition. Uh, I think this might be an older edition, but eh, it's not that bad of a film. I actually think Halloween 4 is pretty good. Halloween 5, uh, The Return of Michael Myers, Special Living Max Edition. I don't like this film, but I am a collector, so gotta catch them all. No. Halloween 6, The Unrated Producers Cut. The Miramax Classics 3 film set with Halloween, it's Halloween H2, Halloween Resurrection, and Halloween Michael Myers. Halloween H2O. Pretty good film. Uh, Halloween 6 sucks, by the way. Halloween Unrated Director's Cut. Not bad. Halloween 2 Unrated Director's Cut. I don't like... I don't like this one! The Woman in Black 2012, and it also comes with The Woman in Black 1989. Captain America Civil War. My opinion that this was the best film of 2016. Just a truly great film. Really love Civil War. Captain America the Winter Soldier, in my opinion, best film of 2014. I really gotta say, because Winter Soldier is just such a great film, in my opinion. They really knocked it out of the park with Captain America the Winter Soldier. Really great. Captain America the First Avenger. Really good, too. I actually like this one. Pretty good. Dead Silence. I think it's underrated. I actually like it, to be honest. And my last DVD, Avengers Age of Ultron. Not a bad film. It's okay. I did like Age of Ultron. Not as good as uh, the other ones, but mm, still good. And that's all for my video, guys, collection. That's all for my collection, guys. If you enjoyed this video, click thumbs up, press subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.